What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Redemption 46 Studios. I'm Nick. Man, y'all seen the picture, y'all seen the thumbnail. Y'all know exactly why y'all here. Y'all want some more BB. BB, Nabi, music video. If this is your first time on the channel, stop what you're doing. Hit that subscribe button. Become a real redeemer today for more content like this. Jump on the Patreon. BB, like, where, where can we start at? Like, I think, I think y'all all know how we feel about her. We love her. Look at her. Just cat was probably being a bad cat. Um, yeah, let's make sure this 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 HD up. Let's put this in HD. Let's, let's make sure we blast this. Show her the respect that she's due. Like I always say this often, because you know it's a lot of guys on the panel and everything. We you know we'll make remarks and be like someone's beautiful and you know we find them attractive and stuff like that. Um, I forget what the word is for it and stuff. Um, I feel like it starts with an S, like like sexual, CPO sexual, or something like that. Um, talent is so attractive when people are just talented at like you know whether it's singing, dancing, rapping, just anything. Like you know, if I see somebody in their element doing something, um, like you know, I, I'll see a, a girl playing a piano or something. That might be like super sexy to me. So seeing her like kill like acting, uh, choreography, singing, rapping, or everything that she does is just a, a major plus on top of like how beautiful she is and everything. You know what I mean? I probably was rambling. Make sure y'all subscribe, man. Y'all know what I mean. <laughs> She got so many different sounds too, man. I heard doing the little cat isms. <laughs> Pretty thing.
Make, <laughs> make sure y'all subscribe, man. Jump on the Patreon for more content like this. She knew what she was doing on here, man. That's all I'm gonna say, man. Like, she, she, she knew. She she knew to walk the line of being adorable and and just being sexy as shit at the same time. Like sis 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 knows what she's doing, man. That should be the thumbnail. But you know I like my cool thumbnails and it's more about the artist than, than us. Sis knows what she's doing, man. That's all I'm gonna say. Um Jesus Christ. Um First off, man, I, this vibe, she's like a Asian India re or something like that. Um, so it's like Neo Soul, um, which is kind of funny to say it like that, Neo Soul. Um, like vibes, um, as far as like the production and everything goes. Um, definitely like some light, light a candle music. She knows what she's doing, stop. Um, definitely like light a candle music. I love that she's not boxed into sounding one way. Like, it's, you know, I see life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. BB reactions are, are, are the same way. You almost never know what you're going to get. You know that, you know, you're going to get some talented vocals, maybe some rapping, and you know she's going to be fucking gorgeous. But outside of that, it's just like, you know, you don't know what type of genre of music like you're going to be getting. You just know you're going to be in for a treat. And she just walks like this good line of. It's hard for people to. Y'all ever listen to somebody and you be like, yo, this person sounds like an indie artist. That means like they seem like they have an innate feel of the music. That they have a good grasp of like, you know, music concepts and everything. And it seems like they put a lot of hard work and energy into the music. Then you have some people who, who seem like they're pop stars, who I wouldn't say necessarily don't put in as much time with the music, but it seems like the music is generated just to kind of appease a general audience. She's kind of a blend of that because she has tracks where it's just like, oh, okay, this shit is a banger and it feels like it's kind of for the general pop. And then she has these tracks to where it comes across almost like an indie artist. Um, like, you know, artists where you'll catch them on that first CD before they go like, quote unquote, mainstream, even though technically everything feels mainstream now. Um, but, you know, hopefully I'll get my gist of what I'm saying. She, she's so gorgeous. Jesus Christ. Um, shout out to the way they did the video and everything, too. Uh, I, I love the big spotlights. They do it when she's outside and they kind of hitting her with like the gel spotlight kind of thing. Even here, it gives kind of like the old camera look when, um, you know, you're in like the complete dark and you just get kind of like that one light that's kind of like on you. Most of the times when people do those, the shots kind of look retro or vintage. So you kind of need like a certain aesthetic to kind of do the shot. And that's uh, typically the aesthetic that she has right here that looks like an older bathroom or you know, like, you know, an older um, living room and things of that nature. All the fits on here were just dope and just... You know, she carried and stuff. She had a little feet out a couple times. She does something, man. This is special, man. Shout out to the stylist, too, man. She might have been putting these looks together herself for all I know. Jump in the comments. Tell me how y'all felt about this. This was fire, man. I fuck with this, John. More content like this coming soon. Redeemers, love y'all. BB, I love you. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs>